Once we've prayed the Lord's Prayer, we pray for peace, the peace which only God can give and the peace that this feast signifies, to sit down at table with each other, to sit down at table with God, is to anticipate the peace that will come when all is transfigured. So we pray for peace as we come to share the feast and then we share the peace with each other, which is also peace with God. And this again, when we offer each other the sign of peace, is not just an ordinary handshake. It's more than that. It's saying that I believe that you and I are united in the body of Christ. That because of what God has done, all the barriers between you and me are down and that you and I share life in the body of Christ. As we come to share the feast, which is the body of Christ, I say that I believe that you are the body of Christ and you say the same to me. I say the peace of the Lord be with you and you say and with your spirit so that we recognize the truth of each other before we come to share the feast together which is the body of Christ. So the sign of peace is not just another handshake or wishing you well, it's recognizing the truth of whom you have become because of what God has done and you recognizing that same truth in me. And once we've recognized the truth of each other at the table, we can recognize the truth of what it is we share at the feast, that this is not just bread, and wine, that this is the body and blood of Christ because of what God has done.